Hello and welcome to Moonhouse Studio and my series on living with the Qcon Pro X. Just hints and tips from somebody that's trying to use the unit and learn some of the quirks and put those right and accept the ones that I can't. Right, so we've got a, a real issue here. One of the problems is irritating but not life-threatening the other one is just going to completely ruin your mix and the first one is that when you hit various keys on the controller say to bring up your mixer it, it's triggering an, a random note on uh, one of the instruments it happens to be the guitar which is a kind of mandolin-y type um, style instrument but even worse is that if you're actually mixing and um, trying to get your levels right it is going completely haywire so if i play this little section here we'll just loop it round um, and i'll flip through to where the guitar is um, we'll bring up the mixer and you can see what's happening here as i bring up the mixer here going way out of tune I mean you hear it even worse than when you sell it so that's totally unusable uh, what's going on here and what's the solution what you really need to do is have a look at the track inspector and we've got all MIDI inputs as the routing and this is quite standard uh, this is your default setting in Cubase and the problem is it is taking messages off this board and it's translating them into note messages or as, as we said, saw with the fader the tuning messages that are coming through um, now obviously what you could do is you could disconnect your instrument and it wouldn't do it then but you'd have to do that with all of your instruments and every time you selected them um, you're going to find you know if you want to record a little bit more or whatever you're gonna to have to reconnect it and that's just not um, going to work so what you need to do is go into the studio setup down here from the studio menu have a look at your MIDI port setup and across here right at the end is this column um, which will show you all your MIDI ins um, and the icon Qcon Pro X is ticked there if you untick that that will no longer transmit on that all MIDI inputs um, section so let's uh, OK that and now we've got this selected if I bring up my mixer no problems there so but will it still work and will the controller board actually work to control everything when you've got that all MIDI off well yes it, it does so let's just bring up that section again we'll loop it round have a look at that uh, let's just quickly scroll across to my guitar and we'll bring up the mixer in the bottom of the screen for you to see um, and so if I now fade this in and out you can hear no problems at all with the tuning that is working perfectly so that's it that's my um, quick tip for how to avoid these really weird artifacts and tuning problems it, it works in Cubase whether it works in other doors or whether other doors actually have that problem I don't know I'm afraid but um, hopefully that's been of some use and um, yeah I'll see you on the next one